Hey y'all, today I'll be installing this frontal illusion wig that I made using a 4x4 closure and bundles that I got from Don Millie, an Amazon hair company. So if you're interested in watching, go ahead and stay tuned. Say I'm proud of you. You don't have bumps in Africa along the way. and welcome to style spy honey if you're new here welcome to my channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to tap that bell so you don't miss any notifications and if you are a returning subscriber you already know you lit welcome back to my channel today i will be installing the wig that i made in my previous video um the unboxing and wig construction that i did for dawn millie hair um, 4x4 closure and bundles. It was the Brazilian curly 10 inch closure and the 12, 14, and 16 inch bundles. Alright, so this was the first cap that I could find, and I just used a darker color on it to tone down that bright goldish mustard color. And on the wig, I just used the regular concealer color that I usually use. Now, to do the frontal illusion, I cut the folded piece of the closure off. So that folded piece of lace on the end of each side of the closure that's hanging off of the wig, that's what I cut off. And it probably would have been easier to use a scissor, but I couldn't find a scissor, so I struggled with the razor blade. Now y'all, I was surprised myself. And when I put this wig on and how natural it looked, even before I cut the lace off, like look at this hairline. I'll be installing this wig without glue. So I got my got to be free spray and I'm just spraying it on the edge of the hairline. I don't plan on leaving this wig on for long, so I'm not gonna put too much spray then i grab my blow dryer for a couple minutes and let it dry after it dries i then add a second layer of got to be free spray and let it dry again now i didn't add any baby hairs but i did decide to pull down a couple of strings of hair before adding my tropical loose foam and smoothing the hair back and then adding the headband around now, I can't take too much pressure on my head, so I just hold the band down while I dry it. I'm not going to have to do too much styling um, on this wig because I already styled it in my previous video. But I just sprayed some water to freshen up the product that's already on in here and to get those curls really popping like i really love the curl definition and then i grab my la girl pro concealer in the color fawn and define the middle part that i have now y'all when I took this band from my head, I was shocked at how natural this lace appeared. I, I grabbed a razor blade and I ain't gonna lie, I should have found my comb, but um, yeah. So I'm trying to cut as close to the hairline as possible without cutting myself and without lifting the lace so much so it won't leave like that white film and uh, this is what it's looking like so far and i still got a little bit more lace so i'm gonna go ahead and cut that off and i'm gonna grab a little bit of tropical roots foam and press down the very edge of the lace and blow dry it until it's dry. Now 
Now I got my concealer again just to define the part a little bit more. And I'm adding a little bit of makeup to the front of the lace just to give it that, you know, scalp illusion. Y'all, what lace? What lace? Okay. Now I'm just spraying some more water to the front to define these curls and tame down this big hair. And this is the finished look. I am loving this hair. I'm loving how natural and how soft it is. Like, it looks so natural. All the hair information and a link is in my description box below. Big shout out to Don Millie Hair on Amazon. And big shout out to you for supporting Styles by Honey. I love you so much. Mwah.